experts have told me it's been a relatively low food year for our bears, which means they're more likely to wander into town and get their hibernation calories from your trash can. When this happens, the top priority for wildlife officials, of course, is keeping people safe. That part is straightforward. When it comes to relocating bears out of populated areas, that part requires some improvising. There was a lot of plan A, plan B, plan C, plan D. This scenario requires a few options. Getting a bear in a tree out of a busy Littleton neighborhood. Bears are this time of year trying to get as much food in them as possible to hibernate for the winter. So get between them and their food source that might be problematic. It's called hyperphagia. To prepare for hibernation, bears will consume around 10,000 calories a day. This one likely found his calories in somebody's trash. Potentially danger to humans if he had remained in the neighborhood for any while longer. The bear had been there overnight, so West Metro Fire assisted CPW by lifting an engine tower so they could tranquilize the bear. Plan A was to try to get a harness around the bear, lower him to the ground after he was tranquilized. Uh, plan B was could we somehow get the platform of the tower underneath him? But the branches were too thick for those plans. Plan C was probably the bouncy house. Tranquilize the bear and catch him in a bouncy house. So whenever the bear would move in the tree after he was tranquilized, they'd move the bouncy house and then he'd move again and they'd move the bouncy house again. Plan D, uh, I guess, is kind of what happened. He may have clipped the bouncy house just a little on the way down. You know, he fell to the ground. We're told the bear was uninjured and safely transported. But in the process, they got a call from the Highlands Ranch area saying that there was another bear in the tree. This one much larger, but eventually ran away on his own. And bears are notoriously quick learners. They often return to sources of food when they find them. It's why relocation is so important. More important than that, though, is storing your food and trash properly. That Littleton bear, I'm told, was relocated to a remote area and checked out by CPW before he scampered away and reportedly in good health. In Jefferson County, Jamie Leary covering Colorado First.